Okay, what's good guys? I'm making the second half of this video in uh, 1080 so you can hopefully see this a little bit better. Um, the autofocus on this camera is probably going to cause some problems. But this is the finished product of the fast boot factory cable. Uh, as you can see, the wires have been brought through. The four different wires have been brought through the hole on the side and soldered to their respective homes. I'll try to get this. Let's see, you guys. Hopefully, it'll focus. And you can see uh, black goes to the first solder point. The second solder point is one side of the resistor. It's not very good. <clears throat> My camera will not focus. Oh, there we go. Then you can see that there's half of the resistor going into the pin 4. Pin 3 is the green. Pin 2 is white. Pin 1 is <clears throat> the red power wire and the other half of the resistor. And the resistor goes from pin 1 over to pin 4 to get power onto pin 4. And when this is plugged into a computer and then plugged into the Kindle second or the, you know, Motorola or whatever. <clears throat> whatever you de device you have that supports a fast boot cable or a factory cable it boots the Kindle into the well it boots the device into the bootloader into fast boot mode and then you can run uh, fast boot commands through ADB on your computer to unbrick a hard bricked or soft brick device so if you're stuck in a boot loop or even if you've corrupted the system and you know your device won't boot up at all most of the time those issues can be solved with a fast boot cable and it's worth it to mention that uh, this will work without your battery in because there's power on two different pins it's enough power to run the device without actually having a battery in so there's my factory fast boot cable. It's not pretty, but it gets the job done. Uh, I'll put, I'm going to make an image to show you guys the, the uh, location of everything, like where everything needs to be soldered to on the breakout board so that it's a little easier to understand. But pin four five is black, the black ground wire. Pin four is one half of the resistor. Pin three is green, uh, one of the data wires. I think it's data positive. I'm probably wrong on that. There's data positive and data negative. It's the green half of the data. Uh, pin two is the white half of the data. And pin one is the red power wire and the other side of the resistor. And you can use a piece of uh, wire in place of the resistor, but a resistor is just the safest way to go. So you don't have exposed wire running from, because it is, it is distributing power, so you can shock yourself if it's not a resistor. And that's it, guys. I'll make a demonstration video of my Kindle Fire booting into fast boot mode and staying in fast boot mode once this... Uh, cable is inserted. That's it for now. Sworn Leader signing out.